talking about emerson's effect and red drop emerson's effect and red drop scientist emerson and his colleagues conduct several experiments on photosynthesis and wavelength they found out quantum yield so emerson scientist conduct several experiments with his colleagues and found out quantum yield quantum yield what is mean by quantum yield quantum yield means amount of oxygen released per quantum of light is absorbed so quantum yield means amount of oxygen is released per quantum of light absorbed that is quantum yield after photosynthetic process oxygen is released which amount of oxygen is released so that is mainly based on which quality of quality of life the plant will absorb so plants get quality of light they will, they give uh, perfect oxygen so this quantum yield we, uh, their experiments we are shown by a graph we are shown by a graph so this is 400 nanometers 500 nanometers 680 and 700 actually 400 to 700 spectrum mainly 400 to 700 nanometers of light visible light vibgr so 680 we are taken for just our understanding so uh, photosynthetic rate this is the rate of photosynthesis so rate of photosynthesis rate of photosynthesis is high it start it is starting point photo of uh, photosynthesis rate is high and is it place at the place of 680 nanometers of light until 680 nanometers of light it will going on it reaches 680 nanometers of light the rate of photosynthesis suddenly declined suddenly declined so here 680 nanometers of light that photosynthetic rate is suddenly declined from 400 nanometers the rate of photosynthesis is high rate of photosynthesis is high when the 680 nanometers of light the rate of photosynthesis is suddenly declined that is called red drop that is red drop that is red drop red drop means what oh, so red drop red drop means suddenly photosynthetic rate is suddenly declined photosynthetic rate photosynthesis rate is suddenly declined at after 680 nanometers of light after 680 nanometers of light after 680 nanometers of light the photosynthesis rate is suddenly declined that is called red drop that is called red drop and these thing they are concluded emerson and uh, his colleagues and one more thing they are uh, they have conducted experiments continuously and one more thing they found out emerson's effect emerson's effect emerson's effect generally plants are exposed to two types of lights so photosynthesis at 700 nanometers of light photosynthesis at 653 nanometers of light these two type these two wavelengths of lights generally given to the plant body 
plant body will respond it means plant body taken these two types of wavelengths of lights so photo what is that 700 nanometers of light 653 nanometers of light individually uh, they, they given to the plant body first of all 700 nanometers of light given to the plant body the quantum yield is 10 quantum yield is 10 or rate of photosynthesis is 10 times next individually 653 nanometers of light given to the plant body the photo of, uh, rate of photosynthesis rate is that is 53 that is 53 it means individually 700 nanometers of light given to the plant body the quantum yield is 10 individually 653 nanometers of light given to the plant body the quantum yield is 53 next both 700 and 653 nanometers of light given to the plant body the quantum yield in plant that is 72 that is 72 so one time 700 and one time 653 simul changes immediately simul changes so 700 nanometers of light and 650 nanometers of light they are given to the uh, one by one immediately so the plant body give the photosynthetic rate or quantum yield is 72 so sudden increment of this quantum yield increment of the quantum yield compared to this individual light given to the plant body it is more suddenly enhanced here when individual light we are given to the plant body the quantum yield is different when we are added both lights and given to the plant body the quantum yield is enhanced that is called what is that emerson's effect this is Emerson's effect. Emerson's effect. Sudden increment of the sudden enhancement of the photosynthetic rate or quantum yield in the plant body that is called Emerson's effect. Emerson's effect. Based on this, based on this, Emerson scientist and his colleagues concluded in plant body, in plant body. Two type of systems are worked. Two types of systems. Two types of systems are working. Two type of systems are working. It means these two types of light, light 700 and 653 nanometers of light, plant will take in and respond to immediately and given quantum yield. So the plant body taken 700 nanometers of light and 653 nanometers of light. That is two types of systems are working in the plant body. First system is PS1 and PS2. PS1 and PS2. These two types of systems are working in plant body. PS1 mainly take up 700 nanometers of light is absorbed. PS2 absorbed 653 to 658, 680, sorry 680. 653 to 680 nanometers of light is absorbed by the photosystem 2. Photosystem 2. We are generally calling it 680 nanometers of light. 680 nanometers of light. That is. One and photosystem 2. Two types of systems are working in plant body. Photosystem 1 take up 700 nanometers of light. Photosystem 2 take up 653 to 680 so we are generally called them 680 nanometers of light plant the photosystem 2 is absorbed that's why both photosystems are working in plant body mainly proposed by emerson's and his uh, uh, colleagues in next class we are dis discussing about both in the, uh, what is the photosystem 1 what is the photosystem 2 if you like this video please like share comment for more videos subscribe my channel thank you